Well, you know it's late in the afternoon, so I'll do the new ones. In fact, I'll do the new ones. The ones I gotta take to the States without, well, let's see what happens. Do it like this. New glasses. Real glasses. But it's evening. I oh, might be losing my light here. Uh, just real quick. Uh, just real quick. Um, my red Shiraz one. I think this might be the last one. Now I'm taking an international flight. I'll be drinking. No, you shouldn't drink alcohol on international flights. I, I got to go to Cape Town first. Oh, I got to drink wine in Cape Town. My friends, they won't. Eh, Cape Town's a wine old town. No good wines. But I think when I get to the States, I'm not going to be drinking much wine. I'm not going to alter my state much because I got a lot of work to do. Anyway, this morning, I had a, I had a great pleasure. Well, I say this morning, but it was last, it was uh, two, m Monday night in the States. But I listened to uh, Breaking Brown, you know, and it's like uh, like 4.30, you know, 5 o'clock in the morning. I listened to it here because I wake up early anyway. So anyway, so this morning, I had to, I, I actually called in. I called in, but the thing is, so I called in. So I had the great pleasure of talking to Yvette this morning. It was, it was, uh, let me say several things. I'm a radio man. I don't like, I don't like um, to call in on a, on, a, on, a, on a radio program. I like live. You know, there's a friend of mine that's a radio program in New York, BAI, uh, Jim Foyne. Any case, he never had a, a guest or, or remotely. It's always live. There's something about human communication it has to be live because when you're talking uh, to a, a to, when you transmit, and 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 you have somebody on on another electronic thing coming to you, then you have to go there like that. There's there's too much there's too much uh, elect, there's too much stuff in between. For me, it has to be a person to person. That's why when I do my interviews. I usually have leave it on the person I'm behind the camera because I want I can kind of concentrate on that person. I want them to concentrate in the, their their face, whatever happening. I want the camera going back and forth to me and trying to and choose who they get. No, 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 no. So when I do interviews and one on ones and, and like that, always live. I don't I don't do telephone interviews. Don't get me wrong. If I'm, I'm if I'm doing a, a radio program and I, I take telephone calls, yes, yes, yes. But gotta be a good telephone system. I wax on like that. I'm sorry, sorry, sorry. But a bit, so I, so anyway, so I I really called. Um, uh, I wanted. I, I didn't. I called. There's some sort of spiritual thing. I, I realized that I wanted to call from Africa before I left and get to, you know, back to the States because I just wanted to establish that. Also, I just, uh, my call was about uh, uh, something, you know, they usually talk about these politics and reflecting what happens and reacting and reporting what happened. And I'm, my role in this thing, if I, I'm not going to call up every week, whatever have you, but you know, when I, maybe every other week. It will be uh, really about the arts, you know, how we can get, you know, on a, on a level level certain things happening, you know, uh, uh, um, to spread the word of ADUS. So what what use, what happens is basically, uh, uh, Dr. Darry and his wife, and you know, they, they inform um, um, Yvette, you know, Mr. Yvette and, and, and Antonio Moore, Antonio Moore. They, they inform them and then they sort of distill the information and as they distill, they, we see us distilling the information to get our marching officers from one source like that. To me, then you have to take, you take a look at what they've done, look back at what's, what, what their source is and the artists have to take those two those two entities and make art about, about about that. Be it little skits, you know, whatever it is, be it competitions, uh, be it school projects or whatever have you. In other words, you may have little packages. They were talking about uh, the, the, the movement in DC when ADOS in DC at that, that hearing. A woman did, did great work and has a package that has all the points and stuff like that. Those kind of packages, if it goes to a community center after school program or some kind of entity, like even, even, even a, a, a choir, practice a practice a youth choir someplace they can take this and make this into a story hey you know a lot of things if we have a, a, enough time and there'd be enough artists to do what they need to do you know you, there, there could be a whole suite you, you know you know like a, a jazz suite there, there could be a whole opera you know what I mean a, a people's opera a grassroots opera you know a, a, a ADOS opera those kind of things but they have to but but if you but the source has to be grounded, of course you have your own ADOS meaning, but the source has to be grounded for this movement in, in what, I may repeat myself, in what uh, Yvette and Antonio distilled, but also be checked by um, the, uh, the diary and whatever else they put. Anything else on the ADOS, anything associated with ADOS website would, 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 be, the, would be the thing, okay? So, so, so like, so like um, I look forward to everything. 
And it's going to happen. This is gonna, man, this is such a great movement. I can't even, please, great movement. This is great reality. That's the whole thing. <sighs> I'm happy. I'm meaning eat meat, tea from the pack. Pat, 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 meat, tea from the Patterson's taking the trains to bed. Letting you know what I only suspect from a desk of the ADOS that would be the American descendants of chattel slavery.